Okay, so as I start this video, just a quick little disclaimer that I'm aware that this may not always work um, on the first try because I've already filmed this video twice. Uh, and now that I'm trying to do it for a third time, it's not loading. Okay, Art Steps is loaded. I'm going to dismiss this thing at the bottom. Um, when I click the little gray person icon at the top, there's no button for login on mobile, so I'm going to hit the big button that says get started instead. And then scroll down to where it says already a member, sign in. After I sign in, I'm going to switch to landscape mode. And now when I hit the gray person icon, I have change password and profile. So I know that I am indeed in my account and signed in. Um, I'm going to hit profile and then scroll down. My, my account name is sample account. Um, so I'm scrolling down to where it says exhibitions. Then I'm going to keep scrolling until I find the one that my group was working on, which the only one I have in here is called untitled. Friday, December 18th. So I'm going to click it and then it tells me that my device is unsupported. Uh, I don't care. I'm going to continue. And then I don't actually need this to load. I just need to hit this edit button. So I'm going to click that a couple times until it realizes that I've hit it. Come on, cooperate. There it's going. Choo chin. Um, and at this point, I'm going to use the three dots menu at the top of Google Chrome on my phone and tell it to show me the desktop site. And then I have this little menu. It's like three lines and an arrow. I need to click that in order to access the page where you upload your artwork. So you're going to click that. Boop. And now I have add and place your artifacts. So then I click that. And now I have my button to add an image. So I click it from this drop down. I select file. Nope, I select file. Click in the dotted box, then pick a picture from my camera roll done title blah blah blah, blah. you'll want to have your artist statement on your clipboard so you can just paste it in and then you're going to scroll down and change your license type to all rights reserved and hit save and so now your artwork will be here in your artifacts and you can even add it to the walls from your phone but it's definitely a little weird and finicky so if I kind of rotate so I can see a wall that I want to put it on, then I click a picture like this one of my cat and I click the wall. Let's see, did it place it? Oh, it's floating. No, that's my dog floating. It's harder to place the artwork from your phone. Yo, of course, now that I'm trying to do it, it's not working, but it, it kind of worked earlier. It seems to be resetting to a weird view. Um, I don't know. Let's try to put the dog on the outside. Right there. Hey, put my dog here. No, my dog's just floating in space and now it wants me to edit it. <laughs> so, um, oh, freaking annoying to try to add your artwork from the phone. Uh, I mean, to add it to the wall. I can grab my blue arrow, move it back. Grab my red arrow, move it for this direction. Oh, what a pain in the butt. So I definitely recommend actually like putting the work on the walls from a computer. Because as you can see, I'm struggling. But it's easy to upload them to the artifacts from your phone. So Godspeed. I've already filmed this video twice. Uh, 
The first time I accidentally turned off the recording halfway through and the second time my finger was over the microphone so I sounded like I was in a freaking windstorm. And now that I'm trying to do it for a third time, it's not loading. But with patience and persistence, you will be able to do this eventually.